this is Bonnie from SoulStarBliss.com. Thanks for dropping in today. We're going to be doing little mini readings about finances for the first three months of the year. That's January, February, and March 2016. You know what? Let's see what's going on. Let's get started. Hello. This little mini reading is for Capricorn for finances for January, February, and March 2016. Let's get started and see what's coming. Here we go. Finances, finances. Everybody's been asking about their finances. Okay, we're going to do kind of a little general spread and then we'll do each month and see what we can get for it. Okay, let's see here. Looks like things are going to get better for you, Capricorn. The plans you've made or the practices you've changed, that's a good thing. You're going to see... What you started, keep it going. Whatever you started on, keep it going. Even putting five, ten dollars away, you'll see by Christmas next year, maybe you start a Christmas club. But you've realized that when you have the cash, it's, it's much better to have cash on hand. By springtime, which is really not far away at all, you're going to have a sense of empowerment because of things you've started now regarding your finances. It says what you've learned, put into practice, put your worries to rest, just keep going the way that you have been. Um, it says things for work. If there's a place for you to sign up for work to put money away, I don't know, a savings plan, 401k, something like that. Many of you that are thinking about it, now is a good time for you to do that. Relationship-wise uh, to do with money, whether you're with somebody or not, when, when finances are not a problem, um, it says that relationships are better. So there's going to be a much better... Um, for those of you that are in relationships or married or, or with a partner, because of your finances, that will put less pressure on your uh, relationship, making it seem to be better. In January, you're going to be making some commitment um, to continue with your finances, the things that you've put into plan, what you've learned. Now, you may have a little trouble, those of you that are uh, in a relationship, to get your partner on board, but one should do smooth sailing. February, uh, looks like some of you might be planning a trip. Oh, this is good. Wouldn't it be nice to have the cash to pay for that? I believe some of you are going to make a plan. You're going to go on the trip either way, which is a good thing, and it's going to be good for you. It's good for body, mind, and spirit. But you're going to put into plan into to work uh, possibly something where you save for your next trip. And then in March, some of you may be hearing from an old friend. You're going to hear about how um, their finances were not so good. And can you help them? Probably not. Um, but what you can do is learn from their situation. Sometimes when we look at others, we don't, when we see other people's problems, ours look, you know, like we don't have any. So Capricorn, good luck with your finances for the first part of the year. And we'll be doing this several times a year. Thank you so much for dropping by. This is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss.